Hi there, thanks for joining me. Today we're gonna to do something a little different and we're gonna discuss five items that we probably still have in our kitchen that can be used but time has probably made them useless or you know, a bit of a dinosaur in the kitchen. So if you hear shaking, that of course is Archie. But let me get started with the very first item on the list, and that is the crock pot. Now, we all probably have had a crock pot. Some of us may still have crock pots. I personally think I have four of different sizes and ages and even an oval in my pantry right now. But on a day-to-day -day basis, what I find myself reaching for is actually a multifunction pot. This is an instant pot. I also have a Breville Fast Slow Pro and I actually prefer my Breville just because it's a lot more user-friendly, easier to figure out without having to read a book or do some research. Of course, if you already have an instant pot, uh, you probably have it all down. I haven't had mine all that long, just a couple of months, and I still don't know what I'm doing. One of these days, I will probably blow up my kitchen, but hey, all in good fun, right? Um, I do want to say that these crock pots, they never broke, did they? Uh, the one, every one I've ever had is still with me, and as you can tell, this one is a lovely early 90s model. My favorite thing to make in it was a smothered pork chop. So you just put pork chops in, covered it with a can of cream of celery soup, went to work, and that night you put it over some rice and you had a really good tasty meal. So I do hate to admit it, but I could free up a lot of room in my pantry if I would just get rid of my crock pots. Item number two is the kitchen timer. It's a useful item, it's just not a used item because I'm using the timer on my oven or on my microwave. It's a little bit more convenient, I always know where to find it, and I can hear it a little better around the house. So, this little guy, it's time he goes. Third on my list of items I no longer use in the kitchen is a tea kettle. Now, I love a good tea kettle, especially a whistling tea kettle, but it's not something that I actually use every day. Instead, it's just decoration on my stovetop. What I do actually reach for every day is my electric tea kettle. I think it's beautiful, it's convenient, it is quick, and it just is more practical for my every day. Now, one thing I'll never get rid of, and that will be my teapots. I love a teapot. This is a Brown Betty in the navy color. That was a gift from my sister-in-law for Christmas, and I adore it. So, I am afraid my tea kettle might be on its way out. Next up on the list of items headed toward extinction is the good old fashioned lemon reamer or citrus reamer. This of course is a wooden one and it works quite fine. It does a great job of getting all the juice out, but a lot less work goes into this kind of a juicer. You just put your half of a lemon or orange or whatever in it. Well, you'd have to have a larger one for an orange, but then push down and there you go. Juice comes out without the seeds, which, seeds, which is mighty nice. Uh, another kind of reamer that I sometimes use if I have a lot is this uh, kind, if, you know, if I have to have a couple of cups of lemon, fresh lemon juice or something. It's got a collection reservoir at the bottom. It's got a spot to get rid of the pulp and the seeds, and you just put your half of your lemon or lime on there and mess it around with the, or squish it around with the cap. So I do use it, but honestly, what I go to most days when I'm cooking is this one. So, so long, juicer, reamers, no longer needed. Next on my list of items I no longer use 
is my beautiful French blue steel crepe pan. I have made many a crepe in this and I do like it. It's just, I noticed the last few times I've made crepes, I'm just using what I leave out all the time, which is my cast iron skillet. So I'm afraid as far as space and how often I use it, it may be time for the French crepe pan to go adios. So that is my five unused items in my kitchen. Let me know if you agree with those or not and what you might add to the list. I think I have a few more coming up because digging through my drawers for these items, I found some other things that were well hidden that I never use. But I would love to hear your comments and I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe and hit the bell icon. I'm new here, so I need some subscribers. Thank you so much for being here today and I will see you next time. So long.